thank you for joining once again. Um, if you are just coming for the first time on this channel, don't forget to subscribe below. So for today's uh, opportunity, we'll be go logging on to capitalfellowship.org. As you can see on the screen, just go to your browser and type in those um, words and um, you, it will bring you to this page. So what do they do? They provide free capital, uh, bespoke um, mentorship and access to a network of resources to small business owners in Nigeria. So that means that your business must be in Nigeria to enable them to grow quickly and sustainably. So how do you apply? It's, um, I would say, I, I would encourage you to watch the video and to know about the, like, um, the goals and the reason, the objectives, why the founder of this um, program um, did this. Let, let me play for you, for you to see. So you might not hear uh, it. Let's, let's play it again. Hello, my name is Kennedy Ekezie. Some of you may remember me. I am beyond thrilled to announce the Capital Fellowship for small businesses in Nigeria. The Capital Fellowship provides free funding, bespoke mentorship, and access to a network of resources for small business owners to grow their businesses quickly and sustainably. Your mentors are going to be business leaders from companies like Dangote, Nigerian Breweries, and Unilever. If you're a small business owner who is interested in the idea of growing quickly with free funding and mentorship, please head over to capitalfellowship.org and complete the simple application and we'll be in touch with you. Send us a DM if you have any questions and I'm looking forward to reading your applications. Okay, so you see, that was just a very, very short, beautiful pitch by the, um, from the founder. So, um, so just keep scrolling, then you read about the mentors, and what you get, you can get free funding, 100%, like you don't have to return it back. And mentorship as well, you get 100% as well. You know, record keeping software, the network, 100%. And you can get capital up to 200,000 Naira for, to support your business. So if you feel like 200,000 Naira can do something in your business, please don't miss this opportunity. Just try and um, hurry up and apply before the deadline. I believe the deadline is uh, March 12. So you can see the way through the eligibility, you must be a small business operating in Nigeria. You must be a business with less than 10 million Naira in monthly revenue. How many of you make 10 million Naira? per month. So if you do not make that, please, you can still benefit from this. So for finalists who do not have registered businesses, who will support you through the process of registering your business name. Um, as in like, this is a good opportunity. Eh? Like, even if you've not registered your business, this will, will support you and register that. So please, don't do yourself on this one. Don't even sleep on it. So the next one is you must have a smartphone. Uh, you, you, that smartphone that you are using to take selfies, see, this is an opportunity, you just use it generally. Only founders of businesses are eligible. So that means that you must be the owner of your business. It, this thing, these opportunities are not for employees of a business. That means that you must own your own business. Then the next thing, the last one is that you commit to participating fully in the fellowship program from April 1st of this year to April 30th of this year. So. What next now is just like start your application. But before you do that, read through it. Application closes March 10 of this, of this month, as in 10th of this month. And uh, they will start review immediately. Then the first contact, all semi-finalists will be contacted via email. That's, that will be 15th of uh, March. Then between 21 and 23, there will be interview so that they will interview the people that, that have been selected, shortlisted. Then the selection process, the final selection this thing will be March 28th, then they will notify them, then April 1st, they will give you your fund, you will collect your 200,000 Naira. And after collecting of your fund, this disbursement of funds, this fellowship will start, as in it's just, it's just that easy. So all you need to do now, I'm going to get you through the application process, so that it, I'll give share some tips with you. For, for um to make it um easy for you and um you know like have 
bigger and higher chances of getting selected. So let's start the application. I'll just hit um, the button. That's, click on that start application button. All right, it is loading. It is loading gradually. Loading gradually. Loading gradually. Okay, so uh -huh. you can see the main page of the application. So here it is. So all you need to do is Capital Fellowship, let's go. Click on the let's go. Ah, you are going there. Then. What is the Capital Fellowship? So make sure that you read through so that you understand what is it about. This thing is already on their website, which I believe that we've read earlier and we've already talked about it. You also saw it in the video um, on the website. So all you need to do is just click on the continue. So, uh -huh. so when you now click on this continue now, let me put my, my holy somewhere so that you can see this picture very well. What do you get from the program? Mm -hmm. 200,000 era in free capital to support your business with option of follow up grants. As in like, you can even get more. If they see that you are doing very well, you can get more than that 200,000 era. So this next one is by monthly call in chair calls with your mentor for goal setting and progress tracking. Then the third one is support with applying for grants and raising funds for your business. So you can still get more. These people will help you through to even get higher opportunities, not just this one. So um, the next one is free lifetime access to proprietary bookkeeping software for your business, which is very, very good. It's good to always keep your books, to have your book um, recorded and these people are going to help you with a software that will make it easy for you to do that then the last one is free access to closing retreat dinner that might be virtual or in person depending on the pandemic anyways so all you need to do now is just click on the continue button you've already gone through that and you understand what everything that you need that you 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 stand to benefit from this so by the time you've read through this thing you now know that okay no i need to do it very well for you to get these opportunities so just click on continue button now all right so the first one is what's your full name your full name okay let me just use my own as an example my full name is ade jokela cc can you see that is my name okay you press okay what is your phone number make sure to type this correctly so all you need to do is just type your phone number, 080. I'm using my own as an example. Please do not go and type my own, no. 25. Can you see? So, okay. What's your email address? Please make sure to type this correctly. We will reach out to semi-finalists using this email. Which is when? March 15. It's very, very close. Oh. The application closes on 10th of this month. And they will reach out to you by 15th. It is very easy. So just go along with me and just keep doing like that. Just follow the step by step as we are doing it. We will reach out. So just make sure you put your email here. So my planet three hour dot. Um, I already did that. So the next one now. What is the name of your business? Okay. So I need to click OK in this one. So yes, I've clicked OK now. Then question six now. What is the name of your business? Put it there. Please write your business name, not my own. Don't go and write my, my <laughs> Planet 3 hour. Write your own and just press OK. Or you can press your Enter key. Do you understand? So but just, you can just press the OK. Then question seven. Please describe your business. What does it do? So this way, you just have to like describe it like what does your business do? Probably your business do X, Y, Z. Your business is blah, 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 blah. It is, um, it, um, it produces this, it produces that. It helps in um, sustaining the fashion industry. It helps with um, helping with our economy and also export opportunities. It helps in empowering young people and women in the community. You know, just make sure that you put all those things, articulate those words together and don't make it too much. Although they didn't request for like some certain amount of words, but you don't want to be let it, you don't want it to be too bulky. Just make sure that it's something that they will read and easily understand as in like almost the first two paragraphs and that is it. 
So let me press OK for that. Then they want to know in which state are you located. So it's, it's always good for you to state where your business is being operated in. Do you understand? Not you yourself. They are talking about your business because you are trying to tell them about your business. They already asked you your business name. They ask you to describe your business. Now the next thing now, in which of the state are you located in? Not you yourself, girl, girl, but where your business, where you are making that impact, where you are, where you are doing that production, where you are manufacturing those products. Do you understand? Where you are rendering those services. Those are the things that they want to know. That's the state that they are trying to like ask you. Do you understand? So, uh, for my home now, I'm in your states. I've clicked on your states. So the question, question now is, what, in what year did you start your business? All you need to do is just put the year, year 2020, or maybe 2021. So, can you see? Press OK. So, how many hours every day do you spend working on your business? They want to know if it's a full-time work. That is one of the reasons why they ask for these hours. If you say you work less than one hour on your business, they might know that, okay, probably it is not a full-time business. You might probably not be serious about it. Maybe it's just a part-time job. One to three hours, they might be like, okay, that one to like, it's, it's like small. It's not really a full-time. They might feel like it's too like part-time. But three to five hours, okay, that is still good. But when you now say five to eight hours, Okay, they, they might think probably you are doing just two shifts or something. Could be a full time too. Yeah, five to hours, five, five hours too is not bad to eight hours. But when you now say eight hours plus, ah, but, but full time, money, as that is full time. So you can just click, uh, like for me now, we open at nine o'clock, we close by six o'clock. So my own is, my own is like, it's eight hours plus. So that is what I would say by own. For instance, like if you open at 9 o'clock and close by 2 o'clock, your own falls between the 5 to 8 hours. So it's still a full-time job too. The many times you just go and use it to rest at home. So at least, but when you now say less than one hour, honestly, they might not take it serious because they feel like you are not even, uh, you, you, don't, you are not even spending full time on the work. So let's click on that. Then what was your annual revenue in year 2020? That means that they want to know if you've started a business uh, or you've not even started doing anything at all. If it's below 100,000, I just put it there for the whole year. Just put it there. If you make between 100,000 and 500,000, I click on it. If you make between 500,000 and 1 million, please just do that. And if you make more than 1 million, please, between 1 million and 5 million, click on option D. Then if you make above 5 million, click on option E. Do you understand? So whatever category that you belong to, just, just make sure that you click on that. If you are below 100,000 Naira, just click on that. If you are between 100,000 and 500,000 Naira, click on that. You don't have to lie. Just be yourself in this, okay? Nobody is going to use this, although they might want to know how profitable or how um, your income, your revenue, because like um, your revenue doesn't mean that you are you are making money that you are making profits you might be making money and not making profits so depending on the cost of production that you use that will determine the number the, the amount of profit that you make so now probably if you make um, just because you make we might see someone that makes one million era and makes profit of of five hundred thousand era probably fifty percent profit and we might see someone that makes five million era and makes and makes uh, like um, profit of of 100,000 era. Can you see? So like um, just revenue, revenue coming doesn't make, doesn't say that, okay, your, your product is um, profitable or something. So when people are saying that they make so, so, so much of money, they make this, don't get depressed over that. As long as you are making profit, fine. You should increase your revenue as well too, but make sure that you are making profit. Do you understand that? So um, just, just click where, um, where you fall into. Could be between okay let's let's click on c between 500 000 and 1 million era so the next question which is question 12 is play, please paste a link to your business social media page it is very important you know like i always told you the way i wrote it the other time in the previous application i did that you must make sure that you write it like this ww so that they just click on it when they click on it they just it just leads them to the place straight can you see so slash planet 3R, make sure you write everything, everything that you have. If you have LinkedIn, put it there. If you have Twitter, put it there. If you have Instagram, just put everything there. 
Can you see? So that they will see, because you might not be engaged in all of them. But at least one place, they will see something there. Can you see? These are all uh, this thing. Then, if I don't know, maybe they ask of um, websites. But hold the link that you can see uh, most of our work. Then, OK. So I already click on OK. Why are you applying to Capital Fellowship? This place is a very, very tricky question, and they want to use it to understand the reason why you should be selected, what you want from them. Is it just about money? Is it just about, you know, there are things that you need to let organization know that if you are being selected, you are going to, this will help you. They will help you meet your goals. Like, let them, let them feel like without them, eh, you will not achieve those goals that you want to achieve. You, you let them understand that through this program, you will meet peer network. You will be able to grow your network. You, you let them understand that through this program, you will be able to get access to a great mentorship program opportunity. Do you understand? You let them understand that through this program, you will gain access to proven leaders, which will help you to reshape your organization. You will get access to um, innovative technology solution you get access to a lot of opportunities think about anything that you feel like your business needs let them understand that no they are the one that will take you to that next level of your business by the time they see all those things and they know that okay you actually believe in them uh -uh, and you now say that at the end of the day like you believe that you get that funding that will make your work be effective and and also like um you know that's that thing that will help you scale and reach more people because you let them understand that if you are being selected, if you are funded, this thing is not just for the benefit of you only, but for the benefit of others. They want to see if other people are going to benefit from it. So you need to make sure that you do that. So when you just pull out those things, say, ah, Omo, no, Omo, my Dori, Omo, my Wuni, ah, no, this person actually like believe that we can do it. So they will do it. Isn't it? How did he hear about the Capital Fellowship? So did someone tell you about it? Well, you can just put my name up. So you can just say Adejokela CC. At least I told you about this. So all you need to do is just say Adejokela CC. So, um, and just press OK. So, um, can you see, I told you about this. Press OK. Is there someone who you know should apply to Capital Fellowship? Please add their emails here. So if you feel like um, you, you, you have anyone, that can benefit from this opportunity as well, so that um, you don't just, that is not just about you or something. So you can just put their emails here. Let me take for instance now, uh, let me use my other email, jokelinks at gmail.com. So, please just make sure that you, you let people, I'm not going to press submit now. I'm not going to click on submit because um, I've not, I just wrote X, Y, Z, X, Y, Z on those things and it might hinder um, future opportunities. So all you need to do next one is just press your submit and they always say that never submit password. Do you understand that? And they didn't ask you of your password in this application. It's just a Google form whereby or uh, whips, whips form or something. That's what they used on their website. So just make sure that you get this opportunity. Don't say that, okay, we've been, you've been doing it since you've been doing this, you are not winning. Just keep doing it. See, one thing that waste up with is that the more you do, the more you gain, the, 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 the more opportunities that come your way. Don't think that eh, someone that tells you that, okay, I win one, one opportunity or two opportunities in a month, only applied for those two. It will be very rare. It will, before you can get to that stage, it might not be now. So make sure that you apply for as much as you see. For instance, if you want to a scholarship, you might probably apply to like 10 schools or even more. And probably you will get like one or two that will say that, okay, they want you there. Then you now say, okay, which one is even like the best option for me to choose? So don't just give up and say that, okay, oh, uh, me, I'm not, uh, I'm not doing more than two. I'm not even doing it again. Please don't say that. Keep trying. Keep doing it. You, you, you don't know. You might, you might be selected for this. And I wish you the very best. So don't forget to share with your friends so that they, so they can get this opportunity. And um, good luck. And if you have any question, just drop it in the comment below. And I'm going to like answer you when I see them. So bye and God bless you.